Welcome back to Love Beam Squadron, everybody. So, uh, I think we're just gonna... I don't, the only thing I've done is I've upgraded the legs once. That's literally it. We have 80% mecha health and a little more, uh, repair after a knockdown. That's it. I mean, I basically we're set on equipment, and, uh, crafting really isn't that, um... And they're like that great. It's random, so I don't feel like I'll bother with it. I did not realize, though, that we can now get 10% mecha combo damage. So cool. We'll activate that. Other than that, we're just going to keep going. Hey, let's just pick the first thing. Lord God, is going too far now. He's taking Colin's bear from the internet, and the world will go upside down now. <laughs> Haven't got much chance to train since I got here. Being with Love Beam Squadron is nice. They are good people. But sometimes I just like being alone. And of course, in comes Niwo. Well, there goes that. Oh, hi, Tammy. Didn't know you were here. I mean, I could have seen you through the security cameras, but I totally didn't. Hello, Niwazawa. So, uh... Yes? Uh... Did you know that the original name for Pac-Man was Puck-Man? What? Never mind. Do you like coffee? Uh, yes? Cool. <laughs> Am I dreaming? I'll leave you alone forever now. Thanks. Aw, poor Nuo. Well, that wasn't exactly smooth. Sometimes it feels like Ni it's Niwazawa against the world. Meanwhile, in the National Park... This looks like a good place to have a good dance. The legend, most terrifying bear ever made, wants to start dancing. It's the bear who belongs to Colin. It looks harmless, but once it starts dancing, it controls all weak minds around. Definitely some top-notch work from Lord Gaga. Will Love Beam Squadron arrive in time to put an end to this deadly dance? Uh, looks like it, that's a yes. Stop right there, Collins Bear! Go back to Lord Gaga's chambers. Don't threaten me, Love Beam Squadron, or else... Or else what, Furball? You will see. Well, dang, that's a lot of minions. Uh, defeat the boss monster with the assault and keep all your heroes standing. Alright, we can we can do that, I think. We can already finish it. Oh, wow, he doesn't have much health, does he? Uh, still, all those things considered. Now I want to play this. Let's see... Hmm... Let's try something. Oh wait, that's not good, actually. I was gonna do that and then harmonize, and then I realized, oh wait, crap, I can't harmonize after attacking. Uh, let's just move you here and harmonize. Oh wow, the enemies didn't move. Usually they move all over the place trying to get the hell out of the way. Alright. Fanny's gonna do what Fanny does. There we go. We'll have Chris do what Chris does. Uh, lightning dagger. Nice. Uh, actually, you know, should I, should I, what should I do? Uh, we'll, we'll settle that in a second. near you. Yep, time sync will hit all three of them. Nice. You're just outside of your range, yes, Dylan? Maybe I should have put the uh, extra whatchamacallit on. Uh, you know what? Let's stunning pose you. 
just so you're not a threat, and then we'll do the invisibility thing. Challenge me! Dance of Death! Okay, so I think we lucked out. There's no status effects there. <laughs> um, what do you think? Should I just finish it? I mean, it says I can finish it. I'm really sorely tempted. Um, I mean, here's the thing. If I can, if I can get everybody beside it, then I, I think that's a good. There's a good yes for that. I don't need to beat up the rest of the enemies. I really don't. Uh, Stylon's the only one, and Stylon can make it. I think everybody else can too. Even our assault can. Yeah. That should work. Teamwork attack, woo! I mean, with, uh... Tammy involved, that should have extra help, too. <laughs> that was kind of funny, actually. I don't think it's over. Shut up! This isn't even my final form! Suddenly, a friendly figure appears running from the distance. You can only hear the words, Don't! The uh, air, which doesn't really make sense. After screaming a few times and getting near, don't threaten the bear. Oh, that's what you were screaming? Oops, I guess it's too late. Who are you? Sorry, I didn't introduce myself. My name is Jay Santo. I'm one of the field engineers of the engine you were using. I had to hack me into the game to warn you that it's not safe to play with this bear. It's not an ordinary bear anymore. Some 2D testing led me to believe that he could turn into an unbalanced enemy bear. And judging by the flashes, I think it's really too late. Ugh. All the lights started to flash, and suddenly, a total blackout. Oh no, it has begun. I should have come earlier. I'm sorry, Lovebeam Squadron. It will be okay, Jay, don't worry. Growling sounds echo around the area. Something is definitely happening. Colin's bear transformed! Come on now, weaklings! He just transformed into a huge bear! Jeez. I told you. <laughs> Game over, Love Beam Squadron! Well, damn. I mean, a few square house kicks will get rid of them, but you've got to survive long enough to do them. Hey, wait a minute. If you're so glitchy and unbalanced as Jay just said, why do you need so many minions? Are you afraid of us? What? No! I am the greatest of all calamities. No! <laughs> Boldly executed, Niwazawa. Keep Jay standing, defeat boss monster with a finishing move. Okay, we can do that. Jay Santos, what do you have? Uh, debug. Target enemy takes 50% more damage for one turn. Uh, cooldown of three turns. Alright, Collins Beho. Oh, hello there. You are fierce, aren't you? Yeah, they're not lying. Sun resistance, armored. Yes, the, this is one enemy they're, they're, they're not exaggerating about. Colin's Bear does become beastly. However, I still get a free dagger each turn, so go. Yeah, see that? That that was pitiful. Uh, stunning Pose. 
Uh, let's see. What does that do? Reduces dodge, critical dodge, and counter chances. Okay. Well, let's see. I'm gonna I'm gonna weaken him up. I know I probably should have done that first, but and we will let Chris go invisible. I think I'm actually gonna do a combined uh, weapons attack here. That's a free action, too. Let's see if we can stack them. Looks like it. Nice. That should be close enough. Good. See, yeah, yeah, we have you too, don't we? Dragon Sword. Oh, nice. You go, girl. Dance of Death. That's probably gonna hurt now. Nice. Uh, we do need to defeat it with a finishing move, but that's, you know, okay. We can do that. Square house kick. May as well time sink him, huh? I'll we'll move Jay Santos out of the way. not a free, that's not a free skill, but still. Better to use it than not, I say. It's getting close. Let's do that. We're gonna actually go and visit with Chris. Danny's gonna wait there. Uh, how many? Well, that's a free action, so that can wait. Uh, since she's been targeted a lot. what I figured. Haha, <laughs> you do a lot less damage now. Alright, team. Let's get this. Let's, let's get this going. I only do that because I don't know if Tammy actually can do the finishing move. Actually, you know what? Can I move you in, in there, too? Come on, dude. Join in on the finishing strike. Why me? I don't know, because you're a boss thing. We've got to defeat you. That's kind of how this works. 
Holy crud, that was a lot of damage. A lot more than I expected. Oh my god, you did it! I'm off to the lab again. I wasn't expecting that. Good job, Love Beam Squadron. Ugh, thanks for nothing. Now I present you my final form! What a strange situation. But anyway, if Jay left, it's because he knew he could handle it. Right on, let's catch that bear. Go, Mech of Justice, Pringer Z, dude! Okay, let's see here now. Uh, reach combo 7 to keep monster with final strike. Both are well within my means. See if we can do this. Oh, natural. Nice. Uh, let's defend. Nice. Again, I guess. Oh, here, let's see. Ah, oh, no, I missed. I was expecting Uber attack time. No, you're not feeling it, Collins Bear. You're not. You're not feeling it. Let's see if we can get you in one round here. Straight. Sweet deal. No materials, but that's okay. I just love these giant fights over the city. Wonder how they don't crush any of the buildings, though. Wow, first time I've seen that finishing move. So cool. Inspired with my love beam to make my own series. What should I name my dope Sentai group? Go, protectors of the Earth. With Tammy, you are invincible. Okay. Uh, we have an alert. You take good care of Tammy. Hello, love beam squadron. I have never properly thanked you for saving Tammy from Lord Gaga's control. I wouldn't be able to lose another child. My older daughter was kidnapped at the age of 19 by Gar the Gargum Cult. Uh, I nearly lost it when I heard the word Gaga. I'm so glad Tammy is alive and fighting alongside you. You have proven yourselves to be true heroes. Tammy has a lot of hatred for Lord Gaga in her heart, and I trust you to show her the path that a true hero is not vengeance, but forgiveness and peace. The final battle draws near. Do not let us down. It is an honor, Mr. Abo. A long line of heroes stand behind you and accept you as the new champions of Earth. The honor is mine. See, I told you we'd, we'd hear that name again. Tammy's, Tammy's dad. Uh, hello, Love Beam Squadron. It's me again. A lot has happened since last we spoke. With the money you gave me, I was able to start a Love Beam Squadron-themed daycare at my home. <laughs> Aw, now I can provide for my kids without having to be away from them. I'm making so much money that I'm thinking about making it a full-time job. Wow, that's great. Yay. And it's all thanks to you. I can now repay you for what you did for my family. Here's a thousand grand. Use it to fight evil and make my kids laugh while you do it. Aw, oh, that's, that's so great. Oh, let's see. Uh, ha, 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 do -do. Let's see. Don't want that. Don't want that. I'm thinking of going with EDS. The Earth Defense Squad. Um... Because, honestly, I don't need the money. I don't need the fans right now. Um, I've got plenty of everything, so uh, let's boost our guys up. And plus 15% critical. Nice. 
Uh, next episode, please. Talk show, no show. Love Game Squadron is uh, interviewed on a Ra Rachel Laser show. It was a day like any other at Hawk Productions until Prinny, uh, until Stylon came in with great news. Everyone, great news! Don't make such a sus don't make such suspense, Stylon. You know I get anxious. Do you know that famous talk show girl, Rachel Laser? I just received an invitation to be interviewed by her tonight. Whoa, that's awesome! I love her recipes. You'll be so famous. We shouldn't be thinking about fame. This can o this can be an opportunity to defeat Lord Gaga. You're right, Tammy. I believe we can modify our audience booster to use her own signal strength. With that much fan power, we could close the portals to Lord Gaga's dimension for good. So cool. I wonder if Rachel Laser will allow us to do it. Maybe we can sneak in earlier to install it. We won't need permission if no one's around. Haha. <laughs> Rendezvous at Rachel Laser's filming set. Use the teleporter to get inside. But that's wrong, isn't it? Love Beam Squadron arrives at the TV studio for some heroic breaking and entering. <laughs> Just in time. No one's around. Let's do it and teleport out pretending nothing happened. This feels so wrong. But it's for the greater good, I guess. Yeah, I don't think it's a good idea to go public with this. It would freak people out. When everything seemed to be going as planned, a very annoying sound was heard around the set. It was an odd and irritating sound. Something repetitive and extremely happy, but annoying. What is this sound? Maybe it's their alarm? It doesn't make sense. The sound is making me ill. The sound seemed to vanish for a while, and suddenly... Watch out! The curtain moved! And then, after the curtain had opened completely... Yep. There he is. Who are you? Were you the one making that awful sound? I thought you were all enjoying it. I could do it again and again if you like. My name is Cute Dinosaur. I usually stunt colored dinosaurs. But exclusively tonight, the entertainment is you! If we take too long, we're going to get caught. You're right, Paris. We need to dispatch this monster as quick as possible. Hit boss every turn, defeat all minions. I just realized something. I no longer have my uh, my audience boost. Oh, but I can harmonize right away. Okay, good. We're still we're still in this. Uh, let's see. Let's do the harmonize around. Oh wow, you, as I said, usually the enemies move all, all all over the place trying to get out of the way for your guys, but I guess they've stopped doing that. Which is fine by me, it keeps a good number of them in the range for a uh, square house kick. Although I'll admit, I was hoping some of them would move out of way to get even more of them into a range for a square house kick. Uh, let's see. I know what you can do, Chris. You can do what you do, what you do best. See, I love it. You get to do this stuff, and now you get to do all this stuff, and then turn invisible, and so Chris is out of harm's way entirely. It's wonderful. Uh, Tammy, 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 Tammy. Punch that, please. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Milo. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. What's the range on this thing? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Hey, we can make it. Let's do this. That keeps the lead in front. Lead's got more health, so we can take the damage. Challenge me! There you go. Yeah. He's actually awesome. 
It, it's great. He's happy little dinosaur. He's actually like a lizard with a shotgun. It's 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 great. I love it. I love this game. I do. Hey, Rhino, eat this. I I, I love that too. That that was just too good. Well, let's see. I don't think that's quite enough. Uh, but if we, uh, well, no, I want. Uh, does that combine with? I don't know if that combines with a weapon attack. So we're just gonna attack more, and then let. Uh, oh, well. Okay then, ax that. Some people need health, right? Won't kill him, but that's okay. Time sink. I didn't even look at the director instructions. Hit boss every turn. Ah, oh, that's funny. Wait, have I have I been hitting him or did I fail already? That's gotta be failed. I don't think I've hit him every turn. Yeah, done for this turn, but it's already red, so it's already gotta be off. Shockwave! I don't get to use it much, honestly. Um, I don't need to defeat him with a finishing move. Who's left? Tammy and Nebo and... Let's see. Free action, swap mode. Every range attack knocks targets four tiles away and deals 30% extra damage. So let's try something. Bam! <laughs> right in the range. Hey, Fanny, do what you do best. That's okay. I don't need to do all the director's instructions. Now you'll see me outside! I'll make sure to step on this building and smash your hopes of fame. Hurry, to the Pringer Z. I'm with you. Go, make up justice, Pringer Z. Dude! Uh, don't miss any attack, defeat with final strike. I can do those. Extra 10% hit is very nice, I will admit. I was gonna say, it's gotta be close enough. 
I am. Later that day. Our heroes enjoy some victory cupcakes at the hot dog stand. It could have been worse. At least we punched one of Lord Gaga's monsters back where it came from. And we didn't do anything wrong. I was feeling bad about that. How long do you think they'll take to repair Rachel, Rachel Laser's studio? Don't get your hopes up. We're definitely not getting invited there again. <laughs> I guess we're the heroes they deserve, but not the ones they need right now. Oh wow, low audience on that. That's okay though. How is Love Beam Squadron? I love the concept. Okay, who watched Love Beam Squadron's latest? Well, oh, don't want to spoil. Are you having with fun with hashtag Love Beam Squadron? How can they be better? Send at Hawk Productions a few tips. I just love these giant fights over the city. Wonder how they don't crush any of the buildings, though. Interesting. So since I only got half the meter, I guess I didn't get as such rave reviews, so I actually got different tweets this time. That's cool. Almost makes me want to not do as well. <laughs> Our last shipment... This is the hardest email I have ever composed. I have been attacked by the terrible alien forces currently threatening our planet, and all my cardboard was destroyed. There is no order. It's just me, Ken, the actor who played Boxing Box on your first episode. But my days of helping you are done. You are our only hope now, Love Beam Squadron. The order is an idea that may survive through you. Take this orange box and bring revenge to the enemies of cardboard, Ken. All hail, Ken. All hail the card god. May your scissors be ever sharp. Yeah, that sucks. But, but, for us, that means that. That means that we have uh, an extra thing we can use for next stuff eventually. Um, we will, we'll buy some extra. Uh, oops, didn't mean to do that one. Well, you know what I found. Sometimes opening this up actually could potentially save me money. Uh, because the fact that if I get an alien cardboard out of this, um, it saves me, like, a ton of these. Uh, in fact... And now we can do more mecha upgrades, because I need two now. So, 80 defense. We don't really need defense. Uh, how about 90? That's 3% up. I'm thinking of doing it. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I only needed one for that. Oh, okay. Well, we'll get another one eventually for the other thingy. Uh, let's see. Uh, Niwazawa's Mistake. Uh, secret Projects. Steel Alien Material from Cerebro. Not the wisest decision. Got it. That's it. My new invention is almost ready. Even though it's not a sure shot, it's worth a try. Using this device, we'll be able to propel our Pringer Z into deep space along with this TV tower. With some adjustments here and there, we could even return home. Borrowing this alien material from Cerebro without permission felt so wrong, though. But no one understands what I do. They always say it's techno babble. This will be done soon and... Wait, what is that thing approaching the tower? A furry inside of some sort of six-armed mecha? I'm Hexapod, the Shredder, and I will shred your dreams! Mwahaha! <laughs> Whoa! You take us for fools, mortal? We've been watching you since you got your hands on that alien material. Cerebro's chambers were too secure, but you look very lonely here in this tower, don't you? Minions, get that human now! I must protect my invention. Lord Gaga will be so pleased with me. I'll go rehearse my promotion speech. <laughs> Have fun, Niwozawa. Defeat one enemies before harmonize, win in seven turns. Well, I mean... The only way to defeat one is just to attack at playing, so we'll, we'll hope that that works. Although, new, although harmonizing does heal, so that's the good news. Because they are hurting. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Thank goodness, Harmonize heals. Oh, see, yeah, they usually get out of the way. For a double piece. I wonder, will this, uh... You know what? Why not? Oh, I forgot. Because I know why not, because... Yeah. Because that ends my turn. There we go. Phew, I did it. Whoa. Hey, minions, are you... Are, you are late for my promotion party and... Oh. You're still here. A single hero won't be much of a problem, though. Ow! No, you can't. Thanks for the alien material. See ya! Miwazawa, are you okay? We got your SOS from your gadget and came as fast as we could. I'm fine, I guess. I was... Whoa, what is this thing? This is the result of my last research. It's not done yet, but it's almost there. But what does it do exactly? And what happened here? Who attacked you? I had some issues. Hexapod showed up with many of his little monsters. It took the alien material I had in my possession. You had what? Wow, so many interruptions. Why did you have that thing? Cerebro was supposed to be handling it. I know, but it was taking too much time, and with all these things happening... Creating this made me feel more helpful. I know I can't fight as well as you. Miwazawa, you are an essential part of Love Beam Squadron as much as any of us. You could have asked for the alien material. Tariro would advise us about how to handle it. Lord Gaga probably has it by now. And you didn't even tell us what this invention is. It will propel our Pringer Z along with the TV tower into deep space and land them on Lord Gaga's ship. Wait, what? Since the alien material was used by Lord Gaga, we can use it to track down his ship. So that's why he was so mad at us for having it. Exactly, Chris. I've discovered that these materials are a mixture of very rare alien components. Lord Gaga was afraid that we'd learn how to use that information to track him down. So this is our best chance to reach him before his portal plan succeeds. You have a point, Niwazawa, and it does make lots of sense to me, but... We just lost the alien material. No, we didn't. Huh? I made a mistake, but I'm not a fool. I can track the material. If we hurry up, we can still catch that monster. You're a genius, Niwazawa. Let's go, Love Beam Squadron. Yes, indeed. Let us go. And Tammy. What a time to run out of candy at the party. I'm glad there are always grocery stores open here on Earth. There it is. Stop right there, thief. Here for your alien material, I guess? Maybe you want to join my party. Lord Gaga will raise my salary because of you, Niwazawa. The only thing you're paying with your salary is your the only thing you're paying with your salary is a hospital bill, Hexapod. Destroy four mines, defeat boss monster with a finishing move. Okay, we can do that probably. The usual. Oh, I need to actually move there first. Well, if we're gonna do that, we need to, uh, let's see. I just realized something. Oh, I know what I can do with these. Oh, actually, you know what I can do? Ooh, I know what I can do.
There we go. You jerk. Can you heal him, Cylon? Nice. Heal Dugan! Now we'll just have Tammy make some progress towards him. Get on the other side just in case. Deploy mines! That's a lot of mines. Mine, 50. Mines, duration, one turn. At the start of enemy turn, mines explode, dealing damage to heroes and healing the tar- Yeah, so it's the same thing as the plant vine things. Um, uh, let's see. Destroying mines is part of the objective. Uh, let's see. How much- Bam. Uh, you take care of mine. You can take care of mine. You can do your usual. Okay. I almost missed that. You're gonna time sync? I love time sync. If I'm right, the alternatives though is like the powerful sniper shot, but I mean the the, the damage reduction that you get from time sync, I think is more than worth it. How? You punk? A lot of mines. Dude, 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 stop! Good lord. Uh, let's see. I love lightning dagger. Free damage, it's always good. Unfortunately, Fanny does not have a kick ready to get rid of the other two there. Um, actually, you know what I'm gonna do? Hey, Tammy, can you take care of this for me? Thank you. Join up! Buff everybody's uh, attack power. I'll have them take care of the mines here just in case. They probably don't have range on us, but still. I don't know, they look like they have a bigger range than the uh, spores did. Deploy mines! Where are you going? Okay. Of course it was a movement reduction. Of course it was a movement reduction. Why wouldn't it be? Okay. That being the case... Hmm. Three boss runs of finishing move. Is he, he's not really ready yet, so I guess we have another turn.
Uh, that only lasts for one turn, does it? Yeah, it only lasts for one turn, so that's good at least. Well, you're almost dead now, aren't you? Well, really, truly, now it's just a matter of, uh, well, not killing it, because we're not ready yet. And keeping everybody close enough that we can, uh... I'll get around him. Let's just circle a life that. Or circle a friendship that. And we'll just do this. Let's see what the jerk face decides to do. Decides to be a jerk. That's what he decides to do. Alright, Rudy, do you have your, uh... Yes, you do. Thank goodness. Everybody join up. Yeah, oops. There we go. I am not... ...defeated yet. Now you'll get to see my blade spinning. In the real size. <laughs> we can't let that happen. Come on. We need to destroy that big thing. To our Pringer Z. Go, Mech of Justice, Springer Z, dude! Uh, take less than 9,000 damage, defeat with Ma Final Strike. Shouldn't be too hard. The world is saved once again by Love Beam Squadron, the true heroes we need. After the smoke had settled, Love Beam Squadron gathers at Hawk Production to discuss Niwazawa's space project. And that's how it works, in layman's terms. Ouch, my head hurts. But even though the device is now complete and seems to be working, I still owe every one of you an apology. I had no right to borrow that material and put the entire planet in risk. Apology accepted, Niwazawa. 
We all make mistakes, Numazawa. I've learned a lot in the last days about what being a hero means. It's a huge responsibility. But as long as we don't think selfishly, the power of our friendship will carry us to the stars. Literally. Thank you, friends. Sob, sob. Oh, don't you start crying now. Oh, I'll cry too. Who wants to get some curry rice? Yay! Another perfect episode. Hashtag love loops Robin. Hashtag Superman. Hashtag love you guys. Uh, learn the song. How could the series be so good? How dare Love Beam Squadron be so good and fully happiness? Hashtag evil minions. Hashtag boss team. Alright. Uh, let's see. Uh, me, 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 Those revenge initiative losers. Hey, look who's got invited to Nick by Nick Anger to join his little party. A cheap knockoff of a ripoff of some dancing obsessed dudes in Japan. Super great. I guess they just invite anyone these days. But they'll see. You can't ground Spider Boy. Blocked image is X. Image could not be loaded. <laughs> oh, Pete Bark at Daily Bug? Ah. Sorry, Peter Parker. We, we're, we're, yeah. Uh, let's see. I think the next one's the season finale. Miwazawa finishes the gadget that will propel the Pringer Z into deep space, and Love Beam Squadron prepares for the final confrontation with Lord Gaga. Uh, do I do this? Maybe. Ah, screw it. I'll make time for it tonight. Are you sure this is going to work, Niwazawa? Of course I am. It's super simple. Listen. This device I built will use the TV tower as a launching pad to boost our Pringer Z along with this TV tower straight into space, powered by the alien material. Forgive me if I don't feel 100% safe. I'm kind of scared of heights and alien rockets. So, are we doing this or what? Press the button, Niwazawa. Click. Well, back to the drawing board. Is it working? Sure it is. Here we go! Lord Gaga, your time has come. We are almost there. Woohoo! Great landing, Niwazawa. You're kidding, right? Now I'm even more scared of heights and alien rockets. Focus now, Love Beam Squadron. Remember, we're here for Lord Gaga. He will pay for what he did to the people on Earth. I understand your anger, Tammy. But we are here to bring back peace to Earth, not for personal revenge. No, you don't understand. Lord Gaga manipulated you into his big plan and mind-controlled Rudy-chan, but... You have no idea what he did to my friends and family. Those were darker times. Suddenly, an angelic monster appeared. I'm impressed by what you have achieved in the last few months. When I first heard about you, I thought you were just actors. No real skills, no real nerve. It looks like my co-workers were wrong about you. I'm Quingo Hyungo, the Devourer, and I'm here to end your little adventure once and for all. I don't care who you are, we will put an end to Lord Gaga today. Why are you so mad, Tammy? Don't you miss being with us? I will let you reach Lord Gaga on a single condition. And what is this condition? Defeat us! Wait a second, defeat us? Yeah, plural. Come to my aid, mini kaiju squad. Oh, these guys are great. Whoa, what are these things? I'm pretty sure they're not Gwyn... The not Gwynu Force... Say hello to my lone squad. We are going to devour you all. Okay, so interrupt Quingle the Devourer's charging seal and defeat all Kaiju squad before defeating Quench Hyungle. Hyungle. So yes, think of them as like alternate and alternate ranger bad force. So you have uh, Grim Garl, Sewer Turtle, Dejigon, Dejigon, and Mulligan. Uh, what are these? Supporting Hyungle, you know, giving an ability buff, high dodge chance. Giving him the Digigon's Blessing buff, probably an armor buff, yep. Strength buff, maybe, yep. And who knows what that is. 
Um, let's see. Well, I mean, uh, what's his health? Their health isn't so bad. His health is huge. Uh, let's see. Um, Digigon's Blessing is restore health at every turn. Dodge 50, defense 30, 30 attack. The critic heroes of the two tiles away from healing bull are much more likely to be attacked. Interesting. Well, we're going to start with this. I go invisible. Aha! Uh, honestly. spread everybody out a little bit otherwise but otherwise we're just gonna stick together for the moment well except for Chris anyway oh I was gonna say cuz Chris went invisible vulnerability ray I don't know what Hyungul did. Is he charging? I think he's charging. That's not good. Let's see. Sewer Turtle should probably not be right now. Either Grimgarl or the other guy. Let's see what we've got going on here. You know, if all I need to do is attack him... Uh, okay. Maybe I don't just need to attack him. Maybe I need to attack him, like, well. Uh... Maybe I need to do a certain chunk of damage, because I'm pretty certain he's charging. Okay, that didn't work. Uh... Let's see. Do you guys all have stun resistance? No, you don't. Good. Uh... do do <laughs> Oh, you, they do have stun resistance. Why didn't I? Why didn't I get that from them? Uh, I'll probably have Chris team up with someone for a team attack. Uh, probably main guy. Yeah. Oh, hi, you're already, you're all the way over there. What were you doing there? Oh, crap. Danny's almost done for. Don't give up, Love Beam Squadron. Oh, dang, Danny. That's our first loss. This will be your end. Oh, now are you charging? Now you're charging, jerk face. All right, let's see. Uh, are you in range? I don't think you're in range. All right, so first things first. Ah, uh, he doesn't have his gun charm. Okay, first things first. Well, second thing, second. I don't know anymore. Let's teleport. I may actually be very glad for having that in a second. Punch. This hurts. Okay, that didn't interrupt his skill. Uh, what we're gonna do, though... Join up. That way, we can use 5th Gen Phoenix for the first time ever. And we're also going to use Shout of Courage. Alright, cool. Grimgarl's almost down. Can I? I can! Shockwave! Nice. Very nice. You know what's also very nice? Good old square house kick. Nice. 
no. Oh, 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 wow. He only had one hit point left. Ah, nice. We interrupt him. Good. Good, good, good. You getting daggered. Go, guys, go. Uh, let's see. Does anybody need help? Fanny still needs help. Oh, uh, so does Chris. Circle of friendship it is, then. I feel like we can still see Mr. I've only got a hit point left, but we just can't um, attack him. There we go. What are the other way? This will be your end. Maybe. Maybe. I don't think so, but maybe, maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. Probably wrong, but maybe you're right. Let's do this. Just punch him. Haha. -ha. Uh, let's see what we got here now. I think you can punch this guy. There we go. Uh, let's see. I think what I really want to do with Fanny, honestly, I think I want to do this. Oh, that's a free action. My gosh, I need to keep track of what's, what are and aren't free actions, because I swear I lose out on those things all the time. Because uh, they didn't quite get him. Oh, they got him now. This will be your end. Uh... Not really, especially because uh, I don't need to finish you with a finishing move. So, uh, take that. And this. <laughs> I mean, I know finishing moves are cool and all, but I'm gonna I'm gonna take advantage of that the fact that I'm not constrained by them this time around. Uh, actually, is this a free action? That's a free action. How much health do you have? Hey, Frenny. Hey, Stylon. Want to see if we can do something neat? Actually, we should do this. We should totally heal Duke and this guy. Heal Duke and... Pow. I healed you to death. Ugh. I have underestimated you. But there's one thing you're still missing, Love Beam Squadron. What's that? You don't really know who's in charge here. We will burn your world to ashes, just like we did the other planets. Mwahahaha. We came for Lord Gaga. What's he talking about? I don't know, Chris. It's time for its second life. Look at the size of that creature. Is our... Is your... Our Bringer Z in fighting condition, Niwazawa? It should be. We'll find out. Find Lord Gaga later, Love Beam Squadron. It's time to finish this fight. Go, make up justice, Springer Z, dude. All right. Defeat monster twelve turns and finish with a final strike. I don't see that see that being a major problem, but we'll see. Wangle is more difficult than anything we've encountered yet. Also, yay for fighting on a spaceship. Uh, we'll see if he actually makes the gets that off. I don't think he will. So 
me because, you know, I got several tricks up my sleeve. Like a dragon tiger. Take all that last health bar down in one shot. You go, Love Bean Squadron. We did it! Now there's nothing standing between us and Lord Gaga. We've come a long way, my friends. I'm proud of every one of you. This is the final battle. So tense. Go, Love Beam Squadron, go! Yay. Hope they get dinosaur costumes next season. Hashtag Love Beam Squadron. I love Love Beam Squadron. I love it. Sentai fans, it's a must. Love Beam Squadron has six rangers now. What are you gonna do now, Lord Gaga? Huh? <laughs> Check out Love Beam Squadron. Hawk Productions series is amazing. Season 4 is excellent, the best thing ever, but people's expectations for the next season are high. So, 13 grand? Speed's in the finale after recording zero other episodes. You heard that right, after zero other episodes. Uh, let's, I'm, because I'm gonna see, because, uh, I think this is basically it. <laughs> um, so, that's gonna be for next time. I will see you all later. Bye, guys.